Hi everyone, it's Christine with Faith in Books. If you have a reader who enjoys Halloween books, here are some of our favorites. Starting with our That's Not My series, I have That's Not My Witch, That's Not My Monster. These are some of our most favorite and most popular touchy-feely books with something your learners can discover on each page. And Happy Halloween, this is part of our holiday magic series. It's truly like magic as your readers go through the pages and see the images change right before their eyes. If you enjoy making crafts or Halloween things to make and do is a great one to have. Most of the supplies you probably have around your house already so you can make a skeleton out of straws or even finger puppets from construction paper. There are also tons of other fun Halloween activities inside. Another great one is Halloween paper crafts and this is a family crafts book I like to call it. These you can make 3D Halloween models with all the templates inside already. Check this out. Tons of fun things that you can make together. For the most part you just need scissors and glue and then you can cut the templates out and then put them together. How cute are these? This is a classic that we pull out every Halloween. Pop-Up Haunted House is one of our favorites. Look how gorgeous the pop-ups are on each page. How beautiful with doors that you can open and other things you can discover a Halloween must have. In Beast Feast by Emma Yarlett, this is another fun read this Halloween season. This one's about a beast who's just trying to cook up a meal and he sends out invitations while his friends write letters back letting him know what they like and don't like in their food. This is a fun story about friendship that will have you giggling. Speaking of giggling, the School of Monsters series is another fun one that'll have you laughing. We have several different titles you can see in this series. This is great for my beginning readers. Um, there's rhyming text inside. I love the illustrations, the big bold words, and then in the end it even gives you a step-by-step -step on how to draw the characters. Also for my beginning readers, we have our phonics books, two fun titles to get you into the Halloween spirit, Trick or Treat Parakeet and Spider Queen's Halloween. These include phonics-based text and a phonics guide for parents. In our picture books, we have This Little Monster. Using the nursery rhyme, This Little Piggy, this read aloud book is fun for the entire family. And in The Pumpkin Who Was Afraid of the Dark, not every pumpkin enjoys Halloween. Some are afraid of the dark. It's a story about friendship and conquering your fears. Perfect for ages four and up. In our activity books, we have a wipe clean Halloween activity book filled with fun mazes and spot the difference games. All you have to do is use your dry erase pen and you can enjoy this book again and again. For my painters, this magic paint book is one that you can take with you on the go. Just use the paintbrush, dab it in water, and watch the colors magically appear. We also have our reusable magic paint board books, the one you see here in our Water Wonder series. This one, you will use water to bring out the beautiful colors, let it dry, and you can use it again and again. If you enjoy dressing up for Halloween, you'll enjoy helping our sticker dollies dress up in this sticker book. From pumpkin parties to dancing witches, your learners will enjoy putting their costumes together. For my older readers, Dracula might be the perfect read for them this Halloween season. These are one of our graphic novels. Um, this one's entertaining, of course, action-packed, perfect for ages 10 and up. 